But Suzanne and Skylar here for you. We hope you guys had a great week. Listen up for a few announcements. Anyone who wants to be a cheerleader next year, you guys have tryouts this week as well as next week from 3 o'clock to 5 o'clock. Eighth graders, your semi formal is this Friday from 6.30 to 9. We hope you guys have a great time. To anyone who wants to buy a uniform early, the pre-sale starts tomorrow and goes till Friday from 5 to 7. Make sure you guys order your high school yearbook for $80 so that you can be the first to get it. Shout out to all of our class officers who won their elections. Now make some money. Intro reports come out on Thursday, so guess what that means? We're halfway through with the fourth quarter. Good luck to the flag football team with their first playoff game today. And huge congrats to the softball team. They're district champs. Have a great week. My name is Sasha Chin, I'm in 7th grade, and my favorite subject is civics because um, government is interesting to learn about and it will help you in your future life. My name is Nicholas France and I'm in 6th grade and my favorite subject is math because I get to learn new things like algebra and geometry. My name is Fabio Suarez, I'm in grade 6 and my favorite subject is history. I like world history because you can learn about the past and how it's affected the past. Hello, my name is Andre Etheridge. I'm in sixth grade. My favorite subject is math because I get to learn division and fractions, something I never learned before. I'm William Garcia. I'm Aaron Banyard. And I'm Eugene Fittery. And, and we're your Gamers, Gamers Club. Club. Gamers Club is a place to make friends, make rivals, and play new games, something that you're not really used to. There will be a tournament held on May 7th for Super Smash Brothers. It'll be a lot of fun, and we hope you, we have you out there. You can sign up in room 149 with Mr. Binney. And first 32 participants are in. And for more details, go to room 149. Hi. Um, so 8th graders, your semi-formal is next Friday. Um, the cost is $10, and the money must be in by Thursday, and tickets won't be sold at the door. Um, there will be food provided, and you can't wear anything that's strapless, or um, shows your stomach area or your back too much, and you have to use the finger rule, which means that it has to go past your fingertips or at the edge of your fingertips. Um, it's going to be in the cafeteria, and... That's basically it. Did you know that bananas have protein? Well, they do. And did you know that you don't need to get any of your protein from animals to survive? In fact, you can get all the nutrients you need just by eating plants. Now I'm not asking all of you to go vegan, but I am asking you to sign this request to offer more vegan and vegetarian options in our cafeteria. Like what about a drink that isn't milk? Or what about a main dish that doesn't have meat? Myself and a small team will be coming around the cafeteria today, so you'll have the chance to sign. Every name counts. I encourage all of you to join the movement. Good morning, students. Welcome back to Club Corner with me, Jesse Gonzalez, and retired CTV2 anchor, James Belisi. This week is cheerleading trials for middle school and high school. Now we have a special video from our very own Mateo Canarte. The SGA lock-in will take place on May 8th from 4 to 8 here at the school. The SGA lock-in is a chance for any student that picked to be in the SGA leadership class to actually get in. Please pick up your application in room 144. Good luck.
This week we have a special treat for you guys. From students who have been accepted to and are going to, the Florida State University and University of Florida are going head to head in a trivia jamboree. Enjoy. FSU! You are! Approximately how long does it take for the moon to make one orbit once around the Earth? 28 days. I'm going to say two weeks. <laughs> what is the plural form of the word mongoose? Mongoose. <laughs> Mongooses? What do we call the currency of India? Uh, I don't know. Yen. <laughs> <laughs> the trumpet, trombone, and French horn are in which family of musical instruments? Brass. <laughs> what is the name of the stadium that FSU plays at? Do I like the stadium? James. James Doe? <laughs> yeah. It's James, it's James Doe, isn't it? No, it's not maybe not James. What is the name of the stadium that you have played at? Ben Hill Griffin Stadium. And the winner is... UF! Thanks for watching, this has been CTV2, with the latest news here for you.